in East LA, 1970s, Chicano and Chicana artists Patsy Valdez, Willie Heron, Grunk, and Harry Gambo Jr. formed ASCO. In Spanish, ASCO means nausea. Their art would express their social concerns of their community. ASCO used their performance art, public art, and multimedia art as the platform to express their opinions about the social and political turbulence of living in East LA. Their work blends together activism and performance. I had this homemaking uh, class and uh, the teacher used to make the most ridiculous statements in class. She would say, well, all you little Mexicans better do well in this class because someday you're all going to be cooking and cleaning for other people. And I used to think about it and go, what? This lady's nuts. Asco pioneered the no movie art style. No movies used two models of presentation. Latin American photo novella and Hollywood film. In a mock interview for the journal publication Chisme Arte, Grunk explains the three-point dot system that he uses for making the no movies. This system included no film or video, only 35mm still camera, thinking in an 8x10 inch format, and postal distribution. Gambo has characterized the work as conceptually political, addressing politics and violence, political violence, and violence against political activism. While Grunk has described the no movies concept as using Hollywood by mimicking it. The no movies showed a criticism towards Hollywood's lack of La Raza representation in the media. The city became their canvas and they became the pigment. This performance in 1974 took place on the same street that a violent riot between Chicano anti-war protesters and LAPD had taken place four years earlier on the same street. The protest was peaceful addressing the disproportionate death rate of the Chicano military personnel compared to their counterparts in the Vietnam War. They were also protesting the poor quality of the education that their community was receiving. A liquor store called the cops on some of the Chicano customers for fear of being robbed. LAPD assumed the protest had turned into rioting and looting, so responded violently. At the end of the day, Ruben Salazar, a journalist for the Los Angeles Times and Chicano activist, was killed when an LAPD officer shot a tear gas projectile into the Silver Dollar Cafe. The projectile hit Salazar in the head, killing him instantly. Performed in 1974 in East LA, Decoy Gang War Victim is a no movie performance by Asco. In the still photograph, we see a body lying in the middle of a residential street. There are flares across the street, in the background and in the foreground. The stills were sent to local television stations in which these stations believe and reported that the image was a photo of the last gang violence in the barrio. The intent of this performance was to exploit the sensationalism and lack of credibility by lazy news programs. Done in their iconic no movie art style, ASCO transforms the space of a simple storm drain into a monument of Chicano art. They challenge the idea of what is a monument. Here we see Asco 
standing in front of a storm drain. We see them give meaning to trash, almost a parallel to how society sees them at that time.